Hi. Yeah, I'm King's Mills. Lucky to uh, review this gym here, House of Games. Gonna speak to the, the manager in here and just see what the gym is like so you guys can see. So, uh, yeah, let's go in and do it. So, uh, nice to see you. Yeah. And your name is? I'm Caitlin and I work at House of Games. Okay, very good. Um, so you yeah, tell us about the gym, like when did it start and how long, how many years have you been at it? Okay, so this gym opened up just after lockdown finished. Um, that was the 25th of July um, 2021. So we've not been, uh, sorry 2020, we've not been open that long to be honest. Um, the owner, Liam, well, it looks like it's been open a while. You can probably see from the background, it's more of like an old school sort of style. Um, but Liam took it in, sort of renovated it. We kept some of the fundamental, fundamental pieces of kit, like Nitro, Cybex, Life Fitness. If you're well versed in sort of gym, you'll understand like these names of kits are like the best of the best. So what, what Liam did was, he just collated a load of great bits of kit, created a gym that had atmosphere as well as you know great kit and wanted to provide a proper old school bodybuilding gym because there's very few and far between in Leeds, you know, there's a plethora of commercial gyms and um, ones that are potentially targeted at gen pop, which you'd say. Um, but yeah, his, his aim was to build a bodybuilding gym. I think he's uh, he's done a good job there. So that that's basically the demographic that he wanted it to be branded towards, and done a really good job. Um, but we aren't, you know, solely all bodybuilders. Some people who literally just love to train hard. That's the main thing here. Come in, turn your music on, train hard. You know, we've always got someone on the desk put some good music on, it's not like Kiss FM sort of just playing and you get an ad in the middle of it. Um, and you know, it's just, the gym is, it's like where everyone goes to relax and come and just have fun and switch off, which I think we've been able to do really well. So yeah, I want to ask you, when you say the demographics that you want, what, yeah. what kind of demographic comes in? Yeah, so, there's not necessarily one demographic, I would say, because like in regards to age, you know, we've got people aging, raging from about 17 to like 40, 50, so it's not a specific age range, but there's just plenty of people that just want to train hard. So, you know, you don't get people coming in here, sitting on their phone, texting for hours, it's more to come in, put your phone in the bag, get yourself in a machine and you don't stop until you know you've been pinned and you can't do another rep sort of thing which is exactly you know the, the vision that we've got to have so in regards to demographic anyone you know male female everyone's welcome here it's almost like as soon as you walk through the doors it doesn't really matter who you are how old you are it's like you're just here to train yeah because one, one, one of the concerns i feel like yeah, people watching this my have is they may not um, they may not know, like, they may not, they may not think about coming in here because they might be intimidated by the atmosphere. Definitely, I, I understand that, I understand that. I mean, like, first time I ever stepped foot in a gym, albeit it was a gym like this, it was one of the things where I proper had to psych myself up to get in because they are scary on the outside, aren't they? I mean, you know, you've got plates clanging, you've got people making noise when they're training but that's just as a result of them training properly um, we, yeah totally but it's one of the things where I know for a fact that if it was your first time here or your 50th time here you'd still get the same you know someone to come over tell you to do another rep you know push you on and give you some encouragement and like no, I think one of the main things with people having that intimidation, thinking that they're going to come in the gym and going to get stared at, or yes. people are going to think they're judging them, and it's, it's not like that. Once you're in, you know, it's just not like that. You, you know, if you do look at someone, it's like because you're like, oh, they're doing well, they're pushing hard. So it's, it's never in like a malicious manner. Yeah, because I feel like some of the people who are trying to get into shape, 
Of course, yeah. I think he says they can be cautious about who's looking at you. Yeah. If people are minding their own business, doing their own thing, yeah. and if they are looking at you, they might be looking at looking out for you. Like, exactly. You know, might want to give you yeah, yeah. If you're reaching the end of set, someone might come over just to make sure, you know, if you're on bench press, yeah. to make sure that you don't <laughs> collapse on yourself, course, just yeah. looking out for you rather than. Thinking, oh, what are you doing? No one. Yeah, I remember a few years ago, I almost killed myself <laughs> with a bass press. It was, I was doing it on my own, and luckily, some guy was all there yeah. and seen me coming that, back. That's the beauty of a gym like this. Like, whenever I'm going for my quote, top set, so my big set of the day, I know I can ask anyone. You know, sometimes, like, if you know, a different gym, you don't want to ask them in case they steal a rep or. Anything like that, yeah, yeah, but yeah. here you can just ask anyone for a spot. You don't need to know them, do you? Yeah, I like yeah, yeah, so exactly. many people for a spot. I don't know them. Yeah, and but it's still, it's still still healthy. Yeah, yeah, and it's it's more um let's say like intimate because it's like it's more. Like, it really is like yeah. in regards to actual yeah. physical proximity. Mm -hmm. It's not a massive gym, um, and I almost like that because yeah yeah you know um, and at one time we, we don't really have more than seven or eight people in the gym ever and um, we as a member you can come whenever you want you have a qr code if you want if you know if you've got a really busy job and you want to come at six in the morning 10 p.m at night if you're a member you can come whenever just come in and put your music yeah yeah if you're a member you can let yourself in whenever and um, because you know if you're a member and you're and we trust you to come, mm -hmm. open up, lock up. Yeah, um, that's what you, you can lock it up yourself. Exactly, you know, you exactly. I mean, not many gyms that you do no, that. No, <laughs> no. But you can do that here, yeah, you can yeah. lock up yourself. So, um, no, that's, that's, that's real cool. So, um, you, you yourself, like you, you've been training a long time? Or uh, I've been training since I was about 13, but, oh. so that's about six years now. Yeah. Uh, I did get into it pretty young. They're not gonna let me leave a rep yeah, because I'm a girl. Yeah, yeah. They're gonna push me as hard. Push you, yeah. And that's I think, what you want. Yeah, exactly. I think that's one of the things that you know, girls that want this physique. A lot of girls they want to tone up, mm -hmm. as they say, yeah. which they just Some use small waist, yeah. big bum, that sort of thing. And you get that yeah. from training hard. YouTube. So yeah. you know, yeah. and nutrition. Yeah. So Good nutrition. yeah. So like coming here, I think a lot of girls would actually benefit a lot mentally and physically from coming here and just training really hard rather than spinning around at a pure gym doing the same stuff every single week and not seeing results. And not seeing results. Exactly. I know that a lot of you are out there you are <laughs> doing that you're thinking you're saying to yourself why am I not making gains and not making changes because of things like this. Right? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. So yeah, so you, that's what you would say the way. Yeah, definitely. Like the best, the best thing I ever did was find, so I've been to you here. Yeah. Like the dirtiest, oldest gym <laughs> that I can find because I know because I know that it will be the best environment for me and so I've been here like almost two years now and best decision I made.
Yeah, yeah, yeah. One if you want it. One more. Come on. Yeah, that's how you do it. Yeah, that's how you do it. That's what Yeah, that's what you do it. 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 Yeah, that's Give it a try, because I know some of you guys are a little bit intimidated by these kind of gyms, but don't be. It's a great gym. I enjoyed it. And I'm um, hungry now, so I'm going to head over to the Flavor Hut tonight. So I'll see you guys then, all right? Peace.